uh, in this tutorial I'm gonna teach you a simple to-do list uh, we are going to make a simple project to make crowd operations create, read, update and delete operations uh, in, this, in this moment uh, let me tell you uh, what we are gonna to do mm, first uh, we are going to install composer you have to go to composer.org uh, and, and then in this page this web page you download the version that you have your operations uh, your systems uh, this can be windows mac mac os linux or, or ubuntu uh, you go here in my case i have a uh, windows system i uh, simple uh, download this file and execute it and, and that is everything uh, that's all but uh, okay mm, in this moment <coughs> uh, we are going to uh, open a terminal uh, i am going to make a project uh, in this case i'm going to move here uh, to my to my folder uh, <coughs> we are uh, uh, you can see the composer commands composer um, and you can see that i have installed it already in my in my system uh, we are going simply to uh, make our project when you are uh, uh, have a reinstalled composer uh, we are going to in, in, uh, to begin to create our project uh, this is the command composer <coughs> create project <coughs> create project laravel laravel backslash laravel <coughs> uh, to do list that's the name of my of the project I am going to do to you have this, this name or not that you want okay uh, I'm going to to work with Laravel 5.1 uh, that's a good version is very recent uh, enter <coughs> but okay uh, I made a mistake here okay enter and you can see that the project is going to create is going to download uh, all the instance all the dependencies that our project needs uh, in this time uh, it, it takes a few mom um, a moment we are going to 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 wait here a moment uh, i'm going to explain to you the architecture or laravel that's very important uh, you have a view the the, the user he, he is in the view he is going to enter our page when he enters our page made in laravel he is going to route to a project laravel controller uh, he is going to to render that he's going from the road he's going to go to the controller there he's going to interact with the model and he's going to select the right controller that our router is invoking and is going to render that view and is going to present that view to the user that's the main architecture of a uh, laravel that's that's a general idea is very important uh, routes are very important in laravel <coughs> Uh, you can see yeah in this moment the, the project is installing uh, wait one moment and until the project is completely completely installed I also uh, have this presentation here uh, to to tell you about Laravel <coughs> uh, you, you can mm, in this pre presentation we can see a uh, Laravel a good framework a framework for web artisan php that doesn't hold code happy and enjoy the fresh air and a fresh 
phrase that there's, there's in this presentation is a flexible framework you can install con with Composer, clone from GitHub or via Laravel installer. We are working with Composer. That's uh, the command for, for create via installer, via GitHub e, uh, be, be, uh, and via Composer. That's the uh, structure of our project, app, bootstrap. I'm going to tell you about this in a moment. Mm he's going to install a dependencies in the root directory where you uh, create the project mm, okay <coughs> we are going to see how is our project loading mm, i'm going to present to you an example this is an example of a of a laravel project uh, you have app app uh, the very important app uh, there you have the models for by default they are in the root of the app folder the, uh, the, uh, these are the the model the model class in HTTP you have the roads the roads is a very important uh, it's a very very important file because this is the uh, connection the the and the invocation of, of controllers is a glue of our project sort of say uh, controllers Los, the controllers are there in http controllers and you have the controllers here uh, it's a class that extends for base controller where you 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 have in the public you can have your html css and javascript files the right uh, uh, that's the basic structure and the other part very important i told you about the controller and the model okay the database migration is very important in this we have the structure of our web page the our database excuse me in, the, in this database we have the structure of our project right uh, in resources views we have our project our html or uh, the render or the presentation that's going to see uh, our users of the web page right uh, in this moment uh, the project is taking a little bit uh, let's give it a moment it is installing dependencies vale okay mm, let's give it a moment mm, right now i'm going the, the most important thing that i think you most to understand is this architecture it's very important mm. you have other things an ORM or the object relational mapping uh, mm, so it, it, it means that you have objects that converts in relational objects because you have a relational database and an object oriented program okay that's very important to understand too <coughs> that's model view controller or another view of uh, this but i think that's that this is great because it's ha it has a uh, the road the roads is a very important part of laravel okay uh, let's give it a moment it's taking some time to uh, install all the dependencies <coughs> one moment please <coughs> uh, that's the project the structure of the project uh, you can see then that it has model view controller another important thing i need to tell you is it's go to the to the documentation See, simply search for laravel and you have the main page there are 
a lot of documentation uh, well explained to to you to look at and uh, really improve and understand Laravel. Uh, go here to documentation. Mm, in this case, is Laravel 5.2, uh, and we have everything: the installation process. We have the an example. We have routing. An example. Uh, an explanation of how it, how it works. Uh, the routing in Laravel uh, and there are various ways to make routing but okay mm, routing controllers how to you how you can make controllers in Laravel this is an example on a controller uh, you can return views uh, invoke did you have an invocation an example this route is invocation user controller and show profile there you have it user controller and show profile there's an gradient example and you get a parameter id there it is okay it's, this is a controller you have an api rest you can have an api rest with get post and this is the CRUD index, create, store, update, and delete are the CRUD operations are there uh, for working there. Yeah, and in this co in this tutorial, in this simple tutorial, I'm going to te te teach you about it. Controllers and views very important the views how is rendered the view the HTML combined with a uh, PHP code embed embedding embedding that PHP code into HTML code I'm going to teach you about that in this course <coughs> there you have it the project install all the dependencies a lot of dependencies uh, and then it generate generate an application key okay mm, in this moment we are going to t to open that file that we an uh, open folder i am i am working with sublime test you can you can search for it i recommend it it's very it's a very good code editor sublime test uh, simply go here to download and download for your system windows 64 bytes or 32 bytes okay <coughs> i'm going to open that file i, I am going here uh, <coughs> to do list select folder and there you have it you have the app to do list you have one class you have one default this is the road this is a default controller and you have resources views and the view we are going to uh, to start our server php artisan artisan serp <coughs> to do I'm going to 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 that project <coughs> P, P that we have created already PSP artisan <coughs> serp there you have it then I'm going to go to localhost localhost 8000 Laravel that you have it Laravel is here and is working you, you can see the code there you have it Laravel file he who is contented rich and, and there's a phrase there uh, I'm going to t tell you this uh, you can see here the 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 project <coughs> the project you have a CSS and you have Laravel file inspiring quote there you have it a class invoking the method that put that quote there okay that's the generally idea 
how you can work with Laravel. In the, in the next tutorial, we are going to make a complete crowd and this operation, right?